Hello YouTubers, welcome to another tutorial on still on table. Well, this should be the should, this should be the last chapter that I'll be covering on tables. Well, I'll be talking about table table uh, but as but as person and then how to add background color to to table and then talking about class and how to put class and ID on tables. This should be this should be take, this should take like 15 minutes or so. Alright, so on our table, what we create is we just create some table, alright, as usual. Then we create a um, table row. We create table row. Okay. Table row. Then, so under here, we just create tags. We don't create headings. Table data. Let's create table data. Let's say. Oh, okay. Let me copy this. I'm feeling lazy to type, and I want this to be fast. Let's put on 1920. Here. Okay, house in 1920. Let's put house. Let's put I'm coming. Let's put apartment here. Let's put apartment there. All right. So then, let's copy this again to make it three or four. Let's copy this. Okay. All right. I think that's making four. Let's see. Okay, we have four. Let's change the date to differentiate. Okay, this let's change this to nineteen nineteen sixty. Let's change this to two thousand. Let's change this to okay nineteen sixty. Okay, let's change this to nineteen hundred. Alright, so houses we have during that period, I think the berries, I don't know. Alright, so that is that thing. What we need to do is we need to add, okay, let's add a number. We have the border, mm, yeah, like the table. Then let us um, add in. Even though we don't have adding, or let's end to have adding. Then we have a border. We have border here. For that, let's put um solid one piece one piece Okay, yeah, okay. Let's put this. Let's do the same thing. So let's put one piece of solid. Um, let's use solid red. Maybe I should use black this time. All right. Then what else do we need to put here? One thing, once you are doing border space, make sure you don't collapse the border because once you collapse the border, it's not it's not going to work. It's not going to work. I'm to, I ought to use that tire. Alright, so that should do. Alright. So don't collapse the border. What we need to do is to create space between this. Then how do we do this? First, let's bring it down to the middle. So it will be easier for us to, to see. Alright, so and then what else do we need to do? Let's just create um let's deal with a T H and T D. What should we do for them? Let's add them border spacing. Border spacing, let's put um ten pizza. Okay. Okay, but I think but the other space is not working. Oh, sorry. To use the other space, you directly target the table. You target the table directly for it to work. Okay, that's the other space. But I think this is kind of small. Let's make it bigger. Let's use um. No, let me put let, let's put pad in here first. Let me that, that will increase the size. Let's provide it to be 15 pieces. 
I think that will increase the space. Alright, so I think that's better. Then to increase the space in the game, you can put um let's put let's put um let's put the bar space into be twenty. Okay. I think this is better. Alright, this is better. So that's how to create about that spacing. Now you can add background to this to change the background. You simply go to under here, put background color. Let's use what we use for background color. Let's use black. And then we'll use black. Let's use black. Then sure you can there's a little of this. It's black, but you see you can also see the test color. Now to do that, let's change the test color. Change the color, test color to let's change it to white. That actually makes sense. Alright, I think that this is better. So we added the banner color, then we change the test color to grey white, and that is about changing background and, and the likes. Now let's briefly talk. Okay, let me let me make another tutorial on ID and then the likes on add ID, ID using class or ID. Let me see. Let me see. Okay, let's let's do another tutorial on that.